Hello, my name is Brian Lowe, an assistant chief at Murfreesboro Fire Rescue, and today we're going to be talking about our physical ability test, the first step of the onboarding process for Murfreesboro Fire Rescue. The purpose of the PAT is to complete a series of tasks that you would experience during Recruit Academy or in the fire service. On the day of the event, when you pull into the training facility at 701 Bridge Avenue, you will park on the driving pad. Attendants are available to park you. Please follow the directions. Once you arrive, make your way to the pavilion to register. Once you register, take all personal items back to your car and, and secure them in your car. Once you secure your items in your car, please go to the designated area to wait for instructions to start. The first station is the ladder climb. Once you climb up to the ladder platform, the attendant will connect you to a safety rope. You will then be directed to climb the ladder all the way to the top, touch the top rung, and then descend. You have four minutes once your foot hits the bottom rung to complete the task. Once you complete the ladder climb, you will proceed to the pike pole drill. An attendant will be there to give you directions on how to complete. We are looking for 10 reps on each arm. You have two minutes to complete the pike pole drill. Once you complete station two, station three is our forcible entry drill. You will proceed to the Kaiser sled where an attendant will show you how to mount the device. Once you get on the sled, you have three minutes to drive the beam to the opposite end of the sled. Once you complete station three, station four is the search drill. You will proceed to the bottom of the steps, pick up a hose pack and ascend the staircase to the third floor. On the way up, you may skip steps. Once you get to the third floor, you will lay the hose pack down, go through the tunnel, pick up the hose pack, and descend through the interior stairwell. On the way down, for safety purposes, we ask that you touch every step. The time to complete the search drill is five minutes. Once you complete the search drill, we will now proceed to station five, the victim drag. The victim drag is located on the AstroTurf located near the pavilion. An attendant will be there to direct you how to pick up the mannequin. You have two options to lift in the mannequin, underarm lift or use the harness that is provided to drag the mannequin. The mannequin must be dragged 30 feet to complete the course. You have three minutes from start to finish. From station five, you will go to station six for push-ups. For the push-ups, your arms will be at normal spacing. Your start position will be up, arms extended. You will lower to your chest and then back up to arm extended. You have two minutes to complete 15 push-ups. From there, you will go to station seven, the sit-ups. You have two minutes to complete 25 sit-ups. The final part of the PAT is the one mile run. We will run around the outside boundary of our EVOC pad. Cones will mark the course. Once we have a group of 10 to 15, attendants will start to run. Once you start, you have 12 minutes to complete. You must successfully complete each station to pass the test. If you fail a station, your application will be pulled. 